Okay, you guys, happy May 1st, 2023. How's everyone doing today? So what I wanted to show you guys today was actually this, this neighborhood in Big Bear. We're in Baldwin Lake right now. This neighborhood that not many people know about. It's kind of a hidden gem up here. It's an equestrian area. But most people, when they drive through Baldwin, and a lot of people do just to drive around the whole town, they'll never ever go up here. And, it, and this is a whole nother little town up here, you guys. This is pretty freaking awesome. So I thought you guys might enjoy seeing that. And then we got a, a lot of hikes coming up and just stuff of that nature. I'm excited. But yeah, hope you all are doing well. Congratulations to Michelle for winning. I'm very happy for you, my friend. We're excited uh, that we could do this for you guys. <laughs> I mean, you guys have done so much for me and Jay, the owner of that property, such a good dude, like such a good dude. As you guys know, we didn't come close to the requirements and I'm assuming it's because of the, uh, the, um, the asking you guys to, to sign up on Instagram because I, I know for, a, a, you know, a lot of people don't have it. And also it's just a, a pain in the butt, even for a, a big prize like that. So, um, I totally, totally understand. Um, we're going to try to figure things out to make it easier. So you don't have to go to all these different social media sites for the next giveaways and stuff like that. Um, we, we will be doing, uh, my favorite restaurant soon. Uh, I think next week we'll be doing that for you guys. And, uh, I'm looking forward to that and, and I'm going to offer some gift cards as well for that one. Cause when you guys come up here, I want you guys to for sure eat there. So I thought that would be pretty darn awesome to do that for y'all. But yeah, we're going up here further than I've, I have ever been. I don't know what this neighborhood is called, but it's up in the hills and you just don't know that it's here. <laughs> you really don't. I thought you guys might be stoked to see it or people trying to invest in properties up here. If, if you really wanted peace and quiet, I'm telling you, this is the neighborhood. This is the neighborhood. What's up, brother? Um, what are you filming? Uh, my YouTube channel. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Tool. I was gonna say something else, but I didn't because he was being a, a smart Alec. What are you filming? Yeah, it's a free country. It's not private property, buddy. When someone acts like that, I don't tend to be as loving back, you know? But when they're nice, like, hey, what are you filming, buddy? Then I'm super, super happy to uh, be extra, extra kind. But look, guys, there's there's homes way back here. Big, big homes up, up in the hills. We're going to turn around and go back and then... Uh, go down one of the other streets but I'm 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 gonna try and find out what specifically this neighborhood is called because I want you guys to know um, this would be a great air Airbnb neighborhood if they have any Airbnbs up here oh look at these beautiful horses okay how Hey, horsey! Hey, horsies! Oh, they're so, so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. That's what this neighborhood's all about. Most of these houses up here are very well-off folks who do have the equestrian thing going on. Big ranch-style houses. Yeah, you gotta love it. Gotta love it. All right, we're gonna hang a left here on Raymond Road. I mean, look at this, guys. This is a whole nother city up here. <laughs> I think I've only recorded in the eight years I've been doing this twice up here, but I've never really referred to it as a private, not private, but just a, 
a hidden away neighborhood. And I'm telling you, as I said, most of these homes up here are fantastic. Just beautiful homes. Pelican Drive. This is awesome. I mean, this is a huge, huge area. So I hope everyone's doing well today. Hope you guys are having a great day. Hope you had an awesome weekend. A really awesome weekend. If anything interesting happened, let me know. I always like hearing what, what you guys are up to, what you guys are going through, what you've been doing. So big out here. And straight ahead, that Sugarloaf Mountain with the snow topped peak up there. But yeah, we got all these streets that go even further back. Look at some more beautiful horses. Hi, horses! As a kid I used to ride horses I rode Western style like that's how much I actually rode is that like uh, there were some of the the people that rode the English way and I rode Western look at this view from up here of Baldwin Lake it might not look like we're up on a hill but we are oh man that is wonderful And I think this road right here, Aristre, goes way back there. It might go to that Boys and Girls Club, maybe, but uh, I'm not 100% sure. And I just learned something new. I didn't realize that I could get up to where we just were going down this street right here. So that's awesome. I just learned a, 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 you know, a new road. But once again, you guys, when you get into Baldwin, you want to turn on... Uh, I, I think it was called Ponderosa Ranch Road or just Ponderosa. But when you're on Baldwin, um, coming from like, let's say Big Bear Boulevard, then you'll turn right on Ponderosa Ranch. I'm telling you guys, that'd be a beautiful area for you to go hiking. Just just walking through that, 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 that beautiful area, I think you would really enjoy it. Yeah, we got some good views of Baldwin right here. There's still a good amount of water in there, guys. I am very happy to see that. I'm always happy to see a lot of things, aren't I? <laughs> but this is awesome, guys. We're going to be doing fishing videos soon. Um, I might even, when they open the resort for the mountain bikers, buy a mountain bike and, and start doing that, and recording it for you guys. I just really want to represent this town as much as I possibly can. Here's the road you want to turn up, Ponderosa Ranch. As a matter of fact, we're going to head back up. We're going to head back up there. And then turn left and come out the other, the other direction. So I can turn around here, give it the full tilt here. All right. I'm telling you, it looks so beautiful with all that water, you guys. My goodness. Baldwin is a lake. All right, so now if, if you're coming from Highway 18, which would be this direction on Baldwin Lake Road, you'll turn left on Ponder... Or on, Ponderosa Ranch Road. I think one of the old 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 mayors of the town, he lives up here. Pretty cool stuff. But yeah, so it's, uh, it's here's Chaparral Street. We're not gonna be going down that. The next street we're gonna turn left on. And 
And then I know for a fact we can get let out the other way. I just never knew that if we turned right up there that it would take us all the way out. Pretty cool. It's just, it's, it's so big up here. And as you guys can see, some of these homes are just truly magnificent. This is considered Big Bear City, AKA Baldwin, this whole area. But I, I, I always thought there was an, a name for this neighborhood. style properties too. They're just awesome. Yeah, I didn't even know about this whole area for the first four years that I lived here. And, and I drove for Domino's also. I had no idea about this place. When I found out about it, I was desperately trying to see if they had any homes available up here. I really wanted to move up here. long beautiful driveway to someone's beautiful house up there I mean look at how beautiful that is this town really has a lot of beauty you guys you just have to give it or you know uh, for those of you who have been here a lot of times you've you've just got to give it a little more chance and just drive around more and go down s streets you've, you've never been down and sometimes these streets will will open up into something that you never uh, imagined would be there like this whole neighborhood up here. Let's see here. Glad I'm driving the lifted Subaru today, not my new Subaru because I wouldn't be making it through any of this stuff. That's a deep, deep rut right there. Oh, we're gonna hit the hit the bottom right here. I'm pretty sure. Oh, we got lucky. We got lucky. So yeah, you guys, those of you who are still watching, if you have any suggestions on what would be some cool giveaways that you guys would really enjoy, let me know. Cause this channel is about you guys. I want to make sure that I'm doing everything um, that interests you guys, makes, makes you guys happy. I'm sure these free vacations are nice. You know, those are always nice. But maybe if there's some some other stuff, I was, I was thinking about maybe some like boat tours for giveaways or like, a, 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 like a rental or something or um you know some golf up here just like stuff stuff like that but i need your guys's feedback because i want to make sure that i give you what you're looking for all right we're back out on the baldwin lake road and we're just going to take this until we get out of baldwin so we can keep on recording this beautiful lake over here oh my gosh you guys it really is something else
I've told you guys numerous times, about six years ago, they filmed a Super Bowl commercial right here uh, at this dirt entrance to this little lot area right here on the left. And all the TV trucks were parked over here. But yeah, it was right there. And there's a trail that we're gonna take right there as well, one of these days. Also, we'll be getting the Harley back in the next week, apparently. So I'm gonna strap on some of my GoPros and we're gonna have some fun cruising around town. It's, it's such a cool video on the Harley because it just looks like you're flying. It's really neat. Hopefully you guys enjoyed those videos. I just wanna do stuff that for me remains fun to do. Cause if this ever becomes a job, I'm, I'll, I'll probably give up, you know? But I, I love what I do on this channel. As you guys know, I've been doing this for eight years now. I have like 3,300 videos in eight years. That's a lot of videos. Um, yeah, also, forgot to mention at the beginning of the video, we got some snow coming this week. So tomorrow will be the calm before the storm video. I'm excited about that. Very excited about that. So a lot of this water has already receded from this angle. I can see that. guys would be interested in seeing that 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 little town so since it is summertime and there's not as as much weather because in in the summer times usually I, I well not not usually I do for sure I record all of our monsoon thunderstorms that we get up here hopefully we have another great year like that we had a good monsoon season last last monsoon season it, it was awesome hopefully we get that again but that's why I'm doing these these other little videos because you know what like you guys are so good to me and you guys want to know so much more about this area and it's it's just it's such a privilege doing this for you guys i freaking love you guys so much this is so much fun especially responding to all the beautiful comments you guys you guys absolutely rock you, you guys are my heart and soul like thank you so much for everything i'm so thankful for you guys everything you guys do Everything you guys say is just so beautiful. It makes me feel so good. And never forget, I'm always here for you guys. I will always be here for you guys. Always. Without a doubt. So we're coming up to the end of this journey. But if you guys like what you see, I'd really appreciate it if you hit the like and subscribe button for me and hit the notification bell. Because there will be a lot more videos this year than, uh, than, than any other summer because we are gonna be doing a lot more. I'm married now. I spent some good money on a couple pairs of hiking boots for my wife and myself. They'll be here on Wednesday, and then we'll be good to go. I, I bought hiking poles and everything. So we're, we're gonna have a great time. I'm looking forward to it. And once again, please like and subscribe for me. I'd, I'd be so, so grateful. Today, once again, it's May 1st, 2023 in Big Bear Lake, California. It's 1.15 p.m. Um, thank you guys for all the love. I love you guys dearly. Never hesitate to ask me any questions. I'm always here for you guys. Always. Put me to the test and you guys will see. Always, always, always. Uh, now we're crossing Big Bear Boulevard, but we're going to shut it down first. All right, guys. Take care. Until next time. That's Highway 38. But until next time, peace out. Love you guys.